We've got our thumbs up drivers behind the lines. In three, two, one, go. Robots jumping into action, but not their drivers. This part's autonomous. For another seven seconds, robots are acting independently of their drivers. But in two seconds, after that buzzer, drivers take control. 2168 flying off the charge station to try and grab a cube. 7795, that's Norse code. This is their first year back since 2017. So happy to have him back on the field. 9096, bad weather. Looking to score some cubes from the center field. 6690, that is Robo Pride out of Merrimack Valley High School. Scoring a cube on that top shelf of the outer grid. 2168 looking to score in the co-op grid. Co-op grid links between both fields, both sides of the field result in ranking points. So in addition to the links that the alliances are individually trying to do, the alliances are also trying to work together this year during charged up. Got some blue teams midfield trying to pick up some cubes that fallen into the red side, red protected zones of the loading zone. Got some traffic down midfield. Teams are using awesome spin maneuvers all day. Trying to get, you know, out of each other's way. Seconds left in this match. All of our teams currently trying to score some last game pieces before they ascend our charging stations. 6690 docked and engaged at the moment. For those at home, that any robot that's docked but not engaged receives six points each robot. Docked and engaged means that they get 10 points per robot. So teams are looking to score as many points as possible as the end of the last few seconds of this match. That's going to be a close one. Scores on the board. A Red Alliance takes that one home. 69 to 59. 10 point difference. And it looks like it came down to the charge station. Everything else was pretty equal between the two teams, or two alliances, rather. Great work to 